Now to news out of Jefferson County tonight where there are safety concerns at Huffman High School after one mother says no staff members were monitoring the metal detector. Big allegations after a student died there in a shooting last year when another classmate's gun discharged. CBS 42 News reporter Michael Clark's been looking into this. He's live outside Huffman tonight with that mother's concern and tonight a response from the school officials. Michael. Yeah, the district says during peak arrival times, there are staff members here to monitor those metal detectors to make sure that students go through them as required. But during peak, during non peak times, those metal detectors may not be manned, according to the school district. And that's giving some parents cause for concern, especially after one woman recorded a video here yesterday. Sonara Holden's video showed an unplugged metal detector with no teachers in sight, and students appeared to go through unchecked. And Holden knew Cortland Arrington and her family and says that her death last year highlights the importance of making sure that staff members know what is being brought into the school. For her life to be taken for something so simple, I feel like the steps that were taken to make the school safe, they weren't doing all that they could do. Now, Birmingham City Schools says metal detectors are used every day here at Hoffman High School and are rechargeable, so they don't need to be plugged in. It's just one of a part of the safety plan, along with three school resource officers here and a buzzer entry system. But Holden says after she posted that video to Facebook last night when she got here to school today, the police department and the principals were up here at the front of the school monitoring those metal detectors, and she says she hopes it's something that she sees going forward for the rest of the year. For now, reporting live outside Huffman, Michael Clark, CBS 42 News, local coverage. You can count on.